Hi Gemini, welcome back to Omkara Tarot and to your love bite. Uh, Gemini, let's see what's the message here for you today. And uh, yes, these are general collective readings, Gemini. Will not resonate with all of you. Please keep that in mind. Take what works for you. Leave the rest. So let's begin. Welcome back all my subscribers. Welcome in newcomers. Do join us. Subscribe to the channel. Become part of us. We welcome you in. All right, Gemini, somebody wants to send a message. They're not happy. Okay, feeling stuck. Gemini, somebody wants to heal things with you. I think they feel they've made a very foolish or unwise choice. Uh, they, they chose the wrong thing, it seems. Now they're feeling very abandoned, very feeling very left out in the cold. Maybe that's what they did to their person. And uh, somebody could have walked away from them. Now this person, I think, wants to send a message. They want to reveal something because they are not happy at all. They feel none of their wishes are coming true. They feel that person has given up on them and they're feeling very, very stuck. So I'm going to clarify these cards, of course, Jebani. Let's start with some dialogue message cards. Let's see if you guys could say something to each other, what that would be, and then we'll clarify these cards. Gemini and their person spirit. Gemini and their person. All right, let's take a few more gems from another deck. And if any of you are looking for personal readings, my email is in the description box below. You can reach me there. And gems, uh, February is only month I'm doing personal readings. March for personal reasons, no personal readings. I may restart in April. I'll keep you posted. Gemini and their person spirit. Okay, enough. All right, so the first card here says, Your soul is always be with me and mine is guiding you. We will always be together in spirit, even though physically we may be apart. So there's uh, somebody feeling very lonely here. Always on my mind and in my heart. Yes, that's you. Always forever. I'm planning a surprise engagement. I want to ask you to marry me. Will you say yes? I never truly moved on, even though I appear so. This is not the way I wanted things to end. I wish I could go back in time. Judgment. I'm making the decision once and for all to turn this around. I wish I could have been emotionally available and let you in. I can tell when you're speaking from your ego or higher self. Although I love your soul, I must admit, I don't like your ego. I know you think you broke me, but don't give yourself so much credit. I'm not porcelain. I might have a few cracks, but I let the light in and I allowed it to shine back into this world. Don't worry about fixing me so much, as you should worry about fixing yourself. I always felt your loving energy so strongly as a comforting presence. It hurts me when I can't feel your energy anymore. Are you pulling away from me? So James, these were some of your messages, if these were resonating. Let's start your reading with, of course, our angel blessing card. Let's see what my angels have for you today as a blessing, guidance, advice or a message. Okay, so whoever's feeling very lonely, I think Spirit is saying connect to your uh, pets or animal spirit guides maybe. Uh, animals could be really very healing right now. So whoever's in the state of feeling you know, totally depressed and sad and lonely, I think, uh, well, your, your pets could really help at this point and practice makes perfect. Whatever you've been doing, Gemini, continue. I think you're doing a great job. Whatever path you're on, keep following that. So, Spirit, why is the hermit in reverse? Why is the hermit in reverse? Yeah, see, somebody feels they held back from the wrong person. They made an unwise and foolish choice. They held back from the person who they were meant to be with. Yes, again, hermit again. 
right? So this person is now deeply thinking about the wrong choice they made and how they dropped the wrong person, I think. Yeah, now they are, they are absolutely having sleepless nights, stress, tension, uh, you know, feeling lonely and sad because uh, they feel it's over. Maybe they chose the wrong person or they chose the, made the wrong decision here. Maybe left that person out in the cold. Uh, two of pentacles in reverse spirit. One more. Yes, after that I think things just stopped between the two of you. Stagnancy. Uh, five of pentacles. Five of pentacles. My God, five of pentacles. Seven of pentacles. Feeling left out in the cold. Feeling disappointed. Feeling why didn't I invest when, when the time was right. You know, they, they, somebody made a very foolish and unwise choice here. They chose the wrong thing. This could be not committing, they, maybe they chose another person, maybe they made a wrong decision. Now they're very disappointed because now they are feeling abandoned and left out in the cold. They feel that person has totally emotionally walked away from them, leaving them behind. So Eight of Cups, Eight of Cups, Eight of Cups. Yes, now somebody is understanding that they were playing power games, mind games, playing, you know, these silly uh, egoistic games maybe and that cost them a huge cup of love and pushed that person away. Maybe this person was not emotionally open at one point and they took everything as, you know, my way or the highway. Uh, now they are missing that cup of love. So what's the page of one spirit? What's the page of ones? They do want to send a message. They are hoping that uh, this connection is not totally ended. And uh, they want to fight for one more chance because they can't take the stress anymore. They want to now come out of this overthinking, the stress, anxiety. And uh, yes, fight for this connection one more time, hoping there's a chance to revive it. With the moon in reverse, I think this person wants to reveal something. What's the moon in reverse, spirit? Or they want to know, oh, okay. They, <laughs> this person wants to say that, um, that they're sorry, they're sorry or they're sorry they never apologized in the past. They never gave any kind of apology in the past. They uh, spoiled a beautiful soulmate connection. They are very unhappy and they're really missing their person. They are discontent. They keep dreaming of them, thinking of them. They don't want anybody else except them. And now that they're ready for commitment, this is what they, what they want to say. Basically, this person is now very, very unhappy. They feel none of their dreams and wishes are coming true. Nine of Cups in reverse spirit. Nine of Cups. Yeah, ever since that person walked away from them, Maybe, maybe this is a person, the per the giving too much or loving too much and uh, they just thought they could lap it up. And now that uh, the other person has walked away, now all the cups are empty. I mean, eight cups left, nine cups empty now. Even the cup that this person was giving them is gone. So nine, nine of cups in reverse can be more, yes, they drained that person out. I think this Queen of Cups, I was about to say that, a Queen of Cups, overgiving, overloving, and here she comes. Now, maybe one person was just uh, overgiving a lot and they got uh, taken for granted, right? This person could have just taken the cup and dumped it into the ground or just lapped it up and not filled this cup back. So this is, this is the Queen of Cups who walked away. Two, twice I've had this card now. So uh, Seven of Wands in reverse. Seven of Wands in reverse. They are very miserable. They are very miserable. They never spoke up earlier. Maybe this person was, they had control issues or they had difficulty in communication. Now they now they're feeling, oh my God, uh, you know, I don't know how to manifest this back. Maybe they, this person was behaving like a trickster. They're really feeling abandoned. I mean, time and time again, I'm getting these cards, repeating cards, which means this is a strong reading for you, Gemini. So give me one more. Yeah, they feel that they, that the person who walked away, the Queen of Cups, has now taken back their power, is very, very like uh, strict now or, you know, um, going to push them away or going to ask harsh questions or just not interested or just put their boundaries up now to say, you know what, 
I've got my sword up now. You're not going to come come back. And uh, this person is watching though. Spirit says this person has been spying all along, watching this queen, this um, queen of cups become stronger and stronger by the day. There was a card which said that, uh, which said, right? Um, I know you think you broke me, but don't give yourself so much credit. I think they've been watching um, this um, this Queen of Cups become stronger by the day. And uh, now they're losing hope that they can even rekindle anything. They feel the feeling they're getting some bad karma as well. With the Wheel of Fortune in reverse, things are stuck. Things are totally stuck. I don't know. Give me one more spirit. Wheel of Fortune in reverse. Wheel of Fortune in reverse. Yes, this person is devastated. They they are devastated. This person wants to clear the air now. They want to speak their truth. They want to end this past chapter of betrayal or endings or hurt or whatever has been caused here. They, they want to talk about that and they want to maybe pull out these swords now. I don't know. But uh, they want, they, they don't want to fight anymore. So temperance what's the temperance spirit for gemini today as an overall energy yeah they want to come back stable now i knew it this, this person is tired sick and tired of being sick and tired right they've been very depressed for some time they want to come back in and heal the connection they want to come in correct they want to come in slow steady stable uh, hoping that they, there is a possibility of a revival of this connection now it's totally up to this Queen of Cups who seems to have already walked away thinking that they were toxic and uh, well they'll have to really put in a lot of work it seems. So that's what I have for you gems. Till next time then, love and light. Take care. Namaste.